quarters. Yeah. Yeah. One comes in. Okay. <laughs> Starting off on Stadium Two. And gets him with the Hypno Punch, too. Nice little edge guard by Pow Pow. Starman starting off with a little bit of a deficit this game. Starman anticipating, gets a little bit of a string. Fair, a um, couple up airs as well. Yeah, Pow Pow just doing really good jobs staying on the ground and controlling the stage. Starman is going to be getting that up smash, though. Dash attack to up smash. Tries to catch landing with an up tilt or a jab. Didn't work out. Pop out waiting out, waiting out for some kind of option from Starman, but it's not going to work out. Up air is going to be getting the first hit to connect. Tilt to push him off. Tries to go for the drop zone. Fair, but he was a little too low. Right now, Papa just trying to find some way to land. And that little jump back with the forward area is going to be catching him. Starman just trying to keep control, keep, keep Sonic away. Pop out looking for his opportunity to get in. Utilizing dash attack. Not going to use a little spin, spin dash off the edge to try to get the back air. Starman getting some extra percent. And the Pop out trying to STI out of it. F tilt is going to send him pretty far away. Shadows need to get a little bit more of a little bit more distance. Again, utilizing F tilt, and another F tilt going to finish it off. Sitting at around fifty-five percent. Oh, and that time trying to do a hard call out with the F smash on the spin dash. That's where Sonic gets a little bit more of his a little bit more of his damage. He actually took the percent lead. Catches him with the spring. He is gonna be able to kill. Or he was able to set up an edge guard, sorry, not kill. And again, not gonna be able to connect with that up smash. Not gonna Yeah, waiting to use the up B just to make sure he doesn't get clipped out of that hydro pump. Both of them at kill percent. Starman trying to find that forward air. Pop out finding the back air first. Not going to kill off the side. Forward air on the approach. And looks like you got the Phantom Footstool off of the Shadow Sneak, possibly? It's a little bit weird of an interaction. Starman finally does find that forward air, but cross stage it will not kill. And Starman bet, bet it for it all because that's a reverse edge guard situation. Pow Pow has control of the stage, and the drop zone fair is finally going to take game number one. All right, game number one going to Pow Pow. Get that score updated.
Sorry, just checking. For people who are... There's certain people who are panicking because they, they did see that Constructor ending, which is unfortunate. Well, at least for a little while. Hopefully, we'll be able to start back up at a new venue. But as of right now, we have Pow Pow versus Starman, game number two. Last hit situation going in, the, going in favor of Pow Pow with that drop zone fair. This time, Starman counterpicking the battlefield. It looks like, again, just trying to get stray hits every, any, any single chance that they can get. Pow Pow denying that a little towards stage, making the uh, fall apart for Starman, because Starman was tripping to, to the right. Starman catching him with the dash attack. And right now, Starman's not really pressuring Pop on the ledge that much. He's gonna space outside of that Nair, getting to F Smash. Tries to get the water shuriken. It's not gonna work out. Forward air to push him over. And he's going to get the down smash. Not going to be sending very far, but a little bit of a get off me option. Starman's still going to be pressuring him at that ledge. Tries this time with the down smash. Not going to end up working out. This time he gets the spin dash into a back air. And yep, just falling down with the forward air. Starman having a stock lead. And not for long. It's Pow Pow evening it right back up with an F Smash. Is going to shield that get up attack too. Right now, Pow Pow with the momentum. Down throw most likely to push him back further off stage. Oh, and I like the option. He tries to go for the spike hitbox. Rapid jab building up a little extra percent. Now Starman's in control of the stage. Pow Pow trying to find some footing. Yeah, Pow Pow just being extra careful. Homing Attack is actually going to be sending him off stage. And right now, a couple straight hits, and Starman almost has it evened up. And they're just staying outside of that range. Does get the weak hit of back air. Oh, and is going to whiff that back air. Uh, Sonic's back air is strong. It might have been able to kill. It was at low percent, though, and it is Battlefield. That's a little bit extra distance. And that Hydro Pump sending the Sonic right into the punishing, uh, the, the range of punish of Starman. Starman just going to clip with an upgrade, just get back in time. Looks like Papa is probably looking for an F tilt there. Starman setting up this. Starman just being so patient here. Again, using the Shadow Sneak, getting that extra distance. Gets the tech as well, but Pow Pow is ready for a back air. Yeah, with the shield that small, didn't look like he was going to be able to eat up much more. Now Pow Pow's using his options a little earlier at the ledge. You don't have as many as much invulnerability when you're at a higher percent. Yeah, down throw to fair is not true. That percent at all. You can DI that very far. Didn't kill it yet. Grenada's up air isn't that strong. That one probably would have if it would have gotten the finishing hit. And just a stray F tilt. It's gonna be able to take it. Tries to call him out with the up, with the up smash if he was going a little too high. Papa sitting with the control, sitting with the stock lead. Starman trying to grasp and find any way to bring this back. Misses the Nair and a whiff punish with an F smash is going to be able to take game number two. Papa taking it over Starman 2-0.